Hello, welcome back to the Mark Janot Show, the tech show about hacking. Now, it is discovered potentially, there are rumors out there, that there is a Windows 11 spyware. So in this video, I'm going to show you some kind of the settings to disable so you can make sure that you're not being spied on. So talking you through the Windows 11 privacy settings uh, would take quite a while. Instead, let's take a look on this, at the settings uh, that are least friendly to your privacy and provide instructions on how to disable them. There are so many hidden settings that you could easily spend hours trying to find the right setup for yourself. Wait a minute. So we, re we recommend getting by checking the following five categories. Number one, we have Microsoft Edge. Microsoft Edge is Windows 11's default browser and is based in, on Google's Chromium technology. Edge has been lagging behind other browsers when it comes to performance, but that's no longer the case. Unfortunately, experts have found that this is one of, at, of the least private browsers that you can use. Instead of using Microsoft Edge, we recommend switching to a more privacy-oriented browser like Brave. If you decide, however, to continue using Edge, you should... Safeguard your information by addressing the browser's default issues with tracking and save data. Tracking. To minimize data that's being collected about you, enable tracking prevention, and here's how you can do it. In Microsoft Edge settings menu, click on privacy, then search, and then services. Make sure tracking prevention is turned on. Set the tracking prevention level to balanced or strict, right? which is best for privacy, some parts of certain websites might stop working. Next, we have save data. Another way that Microsoft Edge collects and stores your information is through sa saved data. Uh, credit card details, passwords, and addresses are all types of data that can be saved in Edge and potentially extracted by attackers. Avoid letting Edge store your saved data by ensuring the, the following steps. In Microsoft Edge settings menu, click on profiles. Under payment info, make sure, you make sure you save and fill payment info is turned off, right? There's gonna be a save, save and uh, fill payment info. In the uh, Microsoft Edge settings menu, under profiles, okay? So you wanna make sure that that's turned off. Under personal info, make sure the save and fill basic info is also turned off. No way. Under passwords, make sure the offer to save passwords is turned off. Next, we have location tracking. Uh, these are the instructions to turn off location tracking completely. In the, save, in the settings menu, click on privacy and security. Under app permissions, click on location. On the following screen, right, it will, it will pop up on the, the screen. Next to location services, click the toggle icon to off. If you want to use the location feature on some apps and not others, then keep location services turned on. You can then disable location tracking for individual apps under choose apps that can use your precise location. Next, we have ad tracking. By default, Windows 11 tracks your activities and sends the information to its advertising partners who can then show you targeted ads. Your personal information is contained within something called an advertising ID, but this can be turned off if you know where to look. Here's how to do it. In the settings menu, click on privacy and security. Under Windows permissions, click general. Turn off let apps show me personalized ads by using uh, my advertising ID. To further protect your privacy, you can also turn off the other three remaining privacy options in this menu. So that is how you can make sure that you are as protected as possible as not making sure that this Windows 11 spyware out there uh, can get to you. Uh, did you see, did you feel that I left anything out? Is there a better way to make sure that you can avoid Windows 11 spyware getting you? Let me know. I want to know your opinion. Please hit the notification bell. Please hit the subscribe button. I love you. Stay safe. See you on the next video.